Maria's agency now represents the artist's collective coincidence. Maria wants to protect the collective's work. This includes books on chance, music on the subject of chance, software that creates random sentences, and photographs taken at random. According to the Copyright Act, works are literary and artistic intellectual creations that have an individual character. Such works are entitled to copyright protection. The two terms, literary and artistic, are not to be understood in the narrow sense, but in the broader sense. In principle, anything that uses language is eligible for protection as a literary creation. The term artistic includes not only paintings, but also music, photography and film. In addition to fine art, applied art is also covered. Furthermore, computer programs can constitute works protected by copyright. To obtain protection, the first thing is that there must be a creation. This term is used to indicate that the works must be based on the will of a human being. If something comes into being, without a human being having an influence on it, it is not a creation in the legal sense. If a wild monkey, for example, grabs a cell phone and uses the camera to take a selfie of itself, that selfie does not enjoy copyright protection. Yes, it will surprise you, but there has been such a case that has kept lawyers and courts busy. However, in most cases, this condition does not cause any problems. The decisive condition for copyright protection, and at the same time probably the most difficult condition to understand, is the individual character. All works must exhibit this character. Otherwise, protection is not granted. A certain creativity is required, which is reflected in the work. In the case of photographs, this creativity regularly appears in the composition of the photograph. The choice of the object depicted, the framing of the picture, or the exposure can establish the individual character. The arrangement of the components of the picture and the distribution of light and shadow can also be decisive factors. Until recently, so-called snapshots did not enjoy copyright protection in Switzerland. This is because they regularly do not have any individual character. In these snapshots, the photographer was simply at a certain place to a certain time, and he or she pressed a camera shutter. They simply photographed the scenery found. Due to a change in the law, such photos now also enjoy copyright protection. According to the law, they are considered to be works, even if they do not exhibit an individual character. Snapshots are thus also protected by copyright law. Only shots from permanently installed surveillance cameras, dashcams or webcams remain unprotected by copyright law, even after the recent amendment to the law. Dashcams, webcams bleiben ungeschützt.